We are live. Okay. Now I you... think something's off. Something off? This is like normally. I don't know. It's there normally. It's, it's there? centered on the. Oh. Okay. Hi, everyone. Hi, everybody. <laughs> and go live there. Yes. Is it working there? Yay. Let's just. Uh, Make sure that everything's working, that we can hear everybody. and The sound. You know, we have to do all the things. <laughs> the sound. Okay, there, there go. we go. Well, hello, everybody. <laughs> it's uh, Kelly and Savannah with Kelly's Bee Boutique. And, uh, oh, thank you very much, Cindy. We do appreciate it when people like and share our um, live. That is a very helpful thing. So um, who else did I see on there? There was Anita and Cindy and Lori and Carolyn. Hey, Catherine. And Natalie, lots of people on Instagram joining us. We have Christy Knight, and there's a lot of names with a lot of letters. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard um, to, I find that the Instagram names are a little bit harder. Um, so welcome, everybody. If it's your first time joining us, we are trying something a little different today. Um, well, it's not that much different, but we've been, so our brains might seem a little scrambled <laughs> because we have literally been hammering it since the second we walked in this morning because we wanted to reinvent the wheel but we gave ourselves four and a half hours to do it so but that's how we'd always <laughs> <laughs> so we were trying a million different things on our our website and speaking to my web guy and like just doing all the things right and um hey jennifer say hi to rain give her a smooch for me um yeah so we've been trying to do a million things because we were trying to uh do a different format in live. So in last week, we told you that we were going to be going with um, a comment sold. That's the one. Well, guess what? We can't do anything here with any company that is out there. So unless somebody has something that they can tell us, we tried comment sold, but sorry, you live in Canada. So then I found Paloma. I was like, oh, Paloma is even better. And it was way cheaper. Oh, sorry, you live in Canada. Like there's an imaginary line across the country our banking systems are different but other than that like it's not like we speak a foreign language you know a little uh francais once in a while but you know like it yeah, was it's it's, it's been bizarre. ridiculous so we've been trying we wanted to do other things hey cousin uh karen she says let me on there but you know it's karen um <laughs> so um yeah it's been very fr it's been a frustrating week because all of the things that we wanted to do we've had to kibosh which is <laughs> beth says you need to move well, you know, I am half American. I could, I could get a dual citizenship. Really? Yeah. Well, because my my grandfather's American, so my mom's got her dual citizenship, so I can still get it. But so does that mean like Cam can get it? Well, I, and then I don't know how many generations it goes down. Yeah, I can get it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm married for the green card. <laughs> yeah. Well, Wendy, I, it could be. I think I don't know what it is. In, well, the biggest problem actually, we could use comment sold in Canada. But then I had to change my entire website to U.S. dollars, mm -hmm. which um, so my U.S. people would not get their break anymore, which, you know, I know that some of my Canadian people have not found that advantageous because they're not saving the 30 percent that our, my American customers do because of the exchange rate. But then it would have been worse for my Canadian customers because they would have been, then had to pay in American dollars, which would have added another 35% on to their bill. So um, yeah, it just was not going to work. Oh, hey, Debbie, did you have fun? Was it Lisa that was teaching or was it somebody else? She went to uh, LH Bead Gallery. My friend Lisa owns it, and it's a beautiful store, isn't it? Is that the one in? That's Lisa that we met in in with in. Um, oh, with the little. She her daughter had a baby. No, that one. No, no, uh, the other one that um, who husband Tim. Remember oh, we, that we went for dinner with? Yeah, we went for dinner with. She's so nice. Yeah, so, yeah, it was fun. Her and her husband are great. Yeah, so anyway, um, we can't do what we said we were going to do last week. We were 99% sure that everything was going to go the way that we had wanted it to, and it didn't. So um, did you check with Cam? I'm texting him right now. He's asking if we need. Okay. <laughs> Up, so. Yeah, because Grace is at school, so we're, we can't. We have to be careful with our time, because you know we're gonna be talking about a lot of things here today. He, we I will think be. He will. Okay, good. Unless I'm off. Okay. <laughs> we um we will get to the selling of beads in a few minutes. We have a, a new feature because we couldn't do what we wanted to do. I thought, well, let's do something different, and I think you guys are gonna like it. 
it's not a whole lot different, but it's advantageous to your pocketbook. So let's put it that way. So anybody that's hanging out over on Instagram, stick around because you may want to hear the information. So I know we gab a lot. Um, we don't have a script this week. Normally we write a script of everything we're going to talk we about. We really just messed up. Yeah, we had, a lot of things we were today. like filming TikToks and doing all kinds of things this morning. So, um, yeah. <laughs> um, speaking of like TikToks and stuff. So I'm going to start coming out with some more videos with voiceovers. Um, fair warning. I'm a little spicy. <laughs> we're not going to be dropping F-bombs. But I do, it's... They're going to be a little spicier. They're a little spicier. Um, I'm a very sarcastic person, so that will come across in the video. So if you are not into that, uh, sorry, I just scroll by. Yeah, that's all only going to be on TikTok. On Facebook, we're going to keep it completely 100%. And maybe Instagram too. And maybe Instagram. So yeah. there might be a little bit of spice. So if you are offended by like like baby swear words. Like, like the SH word. Yeah, like, you know, things like that. Like, or her being cheeky and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. If those kind of things upset you, then just don't go. Because we're not going to do that on our regular format here. Yeah. But what we found over on um, TikTok and on Instagram is that people like things. The um, youngins like the spices. Yeah, they, and they like <laughs> things just to be organic and kind of fun. And that's mm -hmm. sort of a, a little bit of the way that we want to go over there. So anyway, um, we're just, we're always shaking it up, right? Like I figure if I'm still going to be doing this as an old granny, then I'm going to be having some fun while I'm doing it. Cindy said I'm not spicy. Oh. Uh, Cindy, I'm not spicy on these. <laughs> when you say, I, when he says sarcasm is her love language. This is mine too. I, I always say I have a PhD in it because, you know, having yeah. worked, having worked, um, uh, in a jail, you know, you end up with yeah. being sort of, okay. I'm just looking at that person's, uh, no, look at the second, um, the bottom, that name there. <laughs> so it has a spicy word in it. It's just yeah. spelled, it's spelled a little differently. So, and hello everyone on Instagram. We have lots of, uh, people joined us right now. We will get to beads. Yeah. We usually just kind of chat and gab and tell you about our day and our life and what's going on. And then we will get to new products to we might have a code or two for you today yeah so stick around so, so you can get that because yeah. you're going to want it yeah so we're going to completely be changing the way that we do our lives in the coming weeks i'm not going to give you a date on that because we're at, like literally up to the second of going live we were discussing how we're going to do it so things will look different um they will be better i think in many different ways so uh, <laughs> you see what cam put no spicy our daughter goes to a christian school well <laughs> christian cam, swear cam cam you've met our daughter she is a <laughs> she's she is spicy. a carbon copy of, <laughs> of both of you yeah oh yeah because cam you're sarcastic dear <laughs> oh cam grace is just oh man she told me the other day she looks at me and she said something like she goes how do you like them apples mom I'm like, oh my gosh you're six <laughs> she's six years old and she's pretty spicy already yeah so. she's but she's such a sweetheart so. yeah so you will. anyway all right so let's get down to um let, <laughs> cam goes how dare you mother <laughs> Cam doesn't like the, uh, that's my son, everybody, if you're wondering. Who, and my husband. Who, and her husband. So, <laughs> yeah. um, okay. So a bunch of things we got to get to. So we got, I got a really good um, email yesterday from TRCast, as many people have maybe already seen. Um, they have, um, so, I don't know if they sold, I guess or they sold their um, ear wire portion of their business to a manufacturing company in the U.S. who is already really well known. Um, and some people might be saying, well, what's the big deal? Well, because their ear wires were bar none. They were, they're the most beautifully formed ear wires that sat really nice in your ear. They didn't tip forward like other ones. And um, so I've been hoarding them. I have, I bought a lot, like thousands oh of them, literally thousands of them, but I haven't been selling them because I didn't know what was going to happen. But now that they announced that they are, um, that they have sold that part of their business, I released some. So um, can we just put this camera down? Now we've got to do a new mm -hmm. angle here. So we're going to see if we can make this work on this angle or I can maybe switch, switch it down. Oh, you're good. All right. So you can see it's sort of a tipped angle. So this is their um, sort of their, it's, they call it gray. And I think they were 90-5170-01. I have released 250 pairs of them, which sounds like a lot, but um, we sell, oh yeah, there's- Is that the, the right code? Yeah. Five, is it 5070? I don't know. You'd have to look it up now. Gonna... Um, I thought it was 5170. Probably was. Um, and anybody that is new to the channel, um, Savannah, it's a weekly thing. Uh, we keep a scorecard to see how many mistakes <laughs> Savannah makes on these things. <laughs> 
Just yeah, um, yeah, I did it wrong. You did it wrong. <laughs> so that should be a one. one. So five one five one seven zero. So. Yeah. These are $3 a pair, which I know sounds expensive, but that's because they're made in the U.S. They're made with really good quality um, ingredients, I'll call it. And they are, there's just nothing like them. So super, super excited about Tierra Cast releasing that part of the um, business to somebody that is um, great. Um, and they also, so you can pop us back up. Yeah. Um, and also they have alluded to the fact that they might have some other news coming up in a couple of weeks. So fingers crossed, there's more good news, right? So um, yeah, so I was, I was super stoked yesterday to think that, you know, maybe some things are looking up. So if you have been wanting some of those ear wires, um, we have them. Um, the, I love that gray color because it's more like the antique silver. Mm -hmm. It's my most used next to the antique bronze. It is my most used color. So um, you could also probably use it with a black oxide. You can use it with anything. The chain. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, it's quite... Um, sorry, I need a... It could, it's yeah, one sure. of those things that could kind of pick up different... Yeah. So it's it's just yeah. really a good um, a good, a good color. All right. So also this week, um, I guess I'm going to have to put my, it down again. Um, I did a, another video on Monday. And um, so this was my knotted, uh, knotted check glass bracelet kit. So let me see. I've got to figure out this new angle. So this is the uh, blue and purple, or as our friend Jill calls it, a blurple. I'm going to put it in here because you know yes. what? When I've got it in my hand, you just cannot see it. So this is, the other one fit in here better. Mm -hmm. um, you can even go closer. Can I? All right. Yeah, there you go. There we go. So this has tear cast parts in it. Um, you know, I'm just, I'm struggling with this. It's just this new angle. I think you got to go. There you go. There we go. Yeah. So this is the blue and purple one. And we do have, you know, I wouldn't say they're super, super limited, but we don't have like hundreds of these available. So we, you know, because we don't have a lot of these parts anymore. So if you, uh, we've been getting tons of orders for them. So thank you to everybody that has ordered. Um, but if you like it, uh, now's the time to grab Oh, it's, it's got a Our little ghosty little or whatever. Ghost in there. So this is the uh, uh, sea green and bronze, I think it was. So there we go. That looks, that's a good, yeah, that's, that's a good picture. There. And then it's got the lovely button. So I uh, show you how to knot in between and how to add a uh, barrel knot leather clasp and a button closure with a little uh, ring and a charm. So it's a really good technique. And this is part of my refresh and remake series where I show you um, the new colorways, and then um, I just run the old video. So I'm just reusing content, which is way easier for me. Uh, we could, didn't have these available any longer. And so um, one of my staff said, Kelly, you got to put this one out again, because it's always been super popular. And we give you um, more beads than you need. So you would only need um, probably, you know, most people are going to need what I've done in here, which is, I don't know, I can't remember that how many there are in there. Um, but we do give you more. Oh, there you go, Savannah. Yeah, it looks really cute on. So we give you a couple extra in case you have a larger wrist or maybe you want to take one of the beads in. I don't have make. relatively large wrists and this fits very well. Yeah. I, I mean, my wrists aren't relatively small, small is what I meant yeah. to say. No, I've got a fairly large wrist and it still fits me fine. So, so there you go. So you can... Um, uh, Susan asked an interesting question. Can barrel knots be used when using hemp? You can use barrel knots with anything. Uh, the problem is um, is how it's going to sort of form. So you might have to, the smaller the diameter of the materials that you're using, the harder it's going to be to make a nice barrel knot. So you might have to like, you know, kind of push it back and forth between your fingers and kind of squiggle it together to make it work. Mm -hmm. um, so you can pretty much make a barrel knot with anything. But again, the smaller the diameter, like if I was to try and do it with S long cording, which is what I used on this bracelet in between, um, I could do one. It would just mm -hmm. be very tough to do it. I mean, there are a lot of different sizes with hemp cording, though. Yeah. So you know what I always tell everybody when people say, can I use this and can I use that? Try it out. Try it out. Mm -hmm. I haven't personally tried it with hemp because I don't use a lot of hemp, but I'm pretty sure that it would work fine. So, you know. Let us know how it works, Susan. Yeah. Yeah. You tell us. You do it. Come back and say, hey, it worked. All right. Um, and do we have anything else that um, was new or anything like that that we needed to tell 
our peoples? Uh, I think we should just move into telling them about the code because it's an exciting Okay. Code. Okay. And there will be a tutorial at the end of this. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. So hang a around. A really cute. A really cute one. So hang on till the end for the tutorial. So, okay. So like we had talked about at the beginning, we really wanted to do something different where we were sort of ramping up our live sales. And that's just really a struggle in Canada, it seems, without having to handwrite invoices. So we're going to work on that. But in the meantime, we wanted to give you guys just a little something, a little thank you for um, showing up and for always supporting my business because that's what now allows us to do this every week. Oh, you know what we should have done is screenshot that new page. Well, we can just mirror. Or mirror, whatever I mean. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so can you do that? Yeah, just give me that. Um, so I set up a new page and uh, you will find it by going, um, if you go to the header of our website, I think Savannah's gonna try to I'm screenshot screen it right now. No, I gotta, sorry guys, one we, second here. We just don't wanna lose everybody it's okay <laughs> all right so we're going to show you how to get there so what we're going to be showing you today it has all been moved to a certain um, page so you'll go to online shopping and then you'll drop down to the facebook and youtube live products and you'll click on that and then you know i've got a little blurbage in there because i always have to tell you what's going on and then everything we're going to show you today is on that page to make life a whole lot easier so you don't have to dance around our website trying to figure out, well, where did you say that was? Mm -hmm. what, where is that? How do I find that? So when you just click view more products and then it will take you to the, you know, the bigger, uh, you know. Um, it will bring you everything that we're showing. Yeah. So it's not a huge amount today. I think we have like 36 items or something like that today that we're going to show you. So it's not mm -hmm. a huge amount uh, because this has been a lot trying to get this all organized. But so today, um, until I think I did it until Saturday night um, at midnight, if you use the code um, FB Live, so Facebook Live in the coupon box, anything that you buy just from that page will be 25% off. That's a big sale. It's a huge sale because on my strands that I've got in there, I've got semi-precious strands and I've got uh, check glass strands and I've got, no, I've got semi-precious and Chinese crystal. The most I ever do those on sale is an additional 10% um, because we've changed our pricing. Cause remember we used to do like, you know, double the price and then take 60%. And I just didn't like doing that anymore. So the most I ever did was 10% off. Those are an extra 25% off on the price, already super low prices. We've been watching other businesses to see what kind of pricing they're doing. And we are already way lower in the, if you look at the other Canadian businesses that we were able to find, our prices were already way lower. And now we're doing on these ones an extra 25% off. So these are a screaming good deal. So we don't have tons of strands with a lot of things. No, what, what we have, them, there's just two or three. Yeah. So, so um, you can place multiple orders and we will try and catch those as best we can. Uh, this sale on this page only runs until midnight on Saturday night. And then we may actually, I haven't figured out yet. I may actually close the page down until the next one. So if there's something that you want to buy, I wouldn't wait until, you know, Saturday at 10 PM because mm -hmm. it'll be gone by then probably. And uh, we may just turn off the, we may that feature and have it just a Wednesday to Saturday. Kind yeah, of. it might just be like a special thing. So, um, it, you know, you can shop at night anytime. This is always going to be available on replay. So you'll have, you know, four uh, days of shopping and being able to use that code. But the code is only available on the items in that Facebook Live and um, Instagram Live category. category. Um, you can still put other things in. You just won't get 25% off of those. And you yeah. can't combine this with another code. So I get lots of emails from people saying, well, I'm trying to use the 20% off coupon that you get if you're um, a brand new per customer. Um, with these, you can't combine them. It's like you have to pick your poison yeah. sort of th thing. Excuse me. So, alrighty. So that's a really good deal. So, um, you know, we will we'll leave that running on the uh, bottom there. Or maybe, you know what, you could put up for a little bit for anybody new. You can put up our um, web address. So um, Nancy, the code is FB Live. Yeah, sorry, I probably put too much work into that and put there it is. 
Yeah. I'm going to edit this. I'm going to remove just, it. And just put all of that. You, you, we could probably sure. just um, make it. Um, sure. If yeah. you want to screenshot that, then you can uh, save that. Um, yeah, that's a good idea. Code for you. It'll give me a chance to have a sip of my water. Yeah. I know. My throat's really dry. I think it's because you had the heat on. We got a creeper. What do you mean by a creeper? We got somebody in here that shouldn't be in here. Who is in here? All right. I don't know. Do we need to? Do we need to toss somebody out? If we do, then we'll. I did notice. There was one weird one comment. One weird comment, but yeah. it looks like they're maybe gone. Okay. Well, if you notice somebody, just let us know and we'll we'll toss them out. Yeah. Are they, are Call they, them out. Are they on Instagram? I don't no, know. I haven't seen anything on yeah. Instagram. All right. So I guess we can get underway here and get started. Yeah. So we'll have to get rid of that banner. So screenshot that so that we can get rid of all that stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we are um, discontinuing a ton of our chain. Um the manufacturer has discontinued a bunch of things and so we are too so um the the amounts are all in the website on the on that page so some of them there's only like you know 15 inches available and then i can't get it anymore so if you are wanting a really good deal on this chain um now's the time to grab it it's not all of our chain it's just what i'm showing you today so the first one oh gotta put my gotta put us oh, down yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, guys. Uh, what the, the code uh, again is FB Live, Facebook Live. So just FB Live. There we go. So now we are doing this little bit of a different angle. I'll see if I can. Can I? Yeah, it's probably about as, there. Maybe as good as I can get it. Yeah. So this is our CH1, and it's a, a 16 by 16.5 millimeter by 8 millimeter cable chain. Now all of our chains are the best quality chains that you can buy. And that is reflected in the price. The price is a little bit more because they're not garbage. They are uh, electroplated metals over uh, brass. When they have a brass core, that makes them naturally hypoallergenic. Our chain also does not have any uh, lead or cadmium or any of the bad stuff in it. It and it are uh, they're because they're brass core. They're also pretty much anti-tarnish. We have ours up on the um, wall. That's they're on these like big long rods. And the girls just sort of, you know, pull it like that. And they're up there all the time and they do not tarnish. And honestly, like I've never seen it, but I'm sure if we did see one that was tarnished, we wouldn't sell it. Yeah, we don't we don't sell tarnished metals yeah. to anybody. We just toss it out. So this one is the antique bronze and this is 35 cents an inch. And so you can tell that this is one of those larger chains. And, oh, and I have often taken this chain and just cut off a link because I like the shape of that link. So sometimes I will sacrifice the next link. This is not a um, an open and close kind of, it doesn't have an opening, so you'd have to cut it, but it is a really nice big one. So this would look really cute. Just, I'm gonna try and get that without making too much racket. I want to heck with it. Um, this would be really cute if you just put a, a jump ring on it and then put it over your head as a layering kind of necklace. Mm -hmm. Like just like that, that's all you Simple. need to do. Or you could take a pendant and hang a pendant from the bottom. Super simple. So this is a really great versatile chain. So this is our CH1 in the AB finish. And then we have it in the uh, antique copper. And the antique copper is beautiful. And we have a little bit more of that. And it's the same price. It's also 35 cents an inch. With 25% off. With 25% with off using that code um, FB Live. And then we have our silver and we don't have a lot of the silver, maybe like 36 inches or something like 4. that. 24.5. 24.5. Okay. Yeah. Not a lot. Um, but it's a really great chain. So is that all we have is those three, it just the three, that one, yeah. the three different colors in that. So that is CH1 and you'll find that on that new, uh, part of the website. Okay. How am I going to, where are we going to put these? Yeah, just pass them all right back here. <laughs> okay. All right, when you do something new, it's like we have to, we were trying to do something completely new and I said, I, I can't work with all that stuff in front of yeah. me. All right, so this is CH821 and these are a 17.7 millimeter by six millimeter stretched link chain. And I love these. You've probably seen me use these um, in um, some of my uh, tutorials. I love this one because again, I have taken that link. I'm trying to get it, there we go. I have used that link in tutorials where I've cut that out and actually used that as a link because I think it's just really cool, like using it like a big closed ring. 
It's not money. I think focused. we need to move this because it's picking up the words. Yeah. There you go. There. It wasn't. It was so we'll, focusing. We'll, we'll bring it back, we'll bring in, it back in after. after. Yeah. But this one's got um, the nice thing about this is it's got the long link and then it's got three other links in between. So you can cut this link out and then, you know, use that as like a section. I like to do that with chain because, you know, you're not going to find that um, piece right there as a component out in um, beadland. So you can make your own. And that's what it, one of the things that I always did in my jewelry business when I had it. And if you don't know uh, anything about me, I had a very successful jewelry line across Canada and I was in about 80 stores and I had a multi-million dollar business just making jewelry. So <laughs> how did you stop? Um, because the recession hit in 2008 mm. and I was tired. <laughs> That's fair. You know, so instead I opened up a store. <laughs> Smart. <laughs> yeah. In the middle of a recession, I opened a store. You know, I'm not always the smartest person. But um, anyway, so that is the uh, antique copper. And then this is what's left of the antique um, silver. And you will have seen me use that in... Um, a, I think it was like only a few months ago where I cut this piece out and I dangled it in front of one of the little wood drops that I have. And that was really cute. So that is the antique silver. And then the silver is beautiful. So that is CH821. So I'm going to just pull this back so you can see that. So the best thing to do is if you're on your phone, just take a quick screenshot so that you can remember or unless you like if you're organized and you write things down. Otherwise, I'll try to repeat the numbers, but... You yes. can also just take a picture of your TV if yeah. you're watching us on TV. Yeah, CH821. And the, yes, these have closed links. I don't think that this one is um, open. No, those are all soldered, soldered links. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> yes, Wendy. <laughs> so much more relaxing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, you know, it was, it was, it's all been good. I, you know, I've been having um, some tummy problems this week and Savannah's like, are you stressed out? And I'm like, well, oh, maybe moderately, but not anything that should be causing all these, you know, problems with my tummy. Yeah. Um, but, you know, I think when you have any kind of business, when there is, um, you know, there's obviously there's, there's changes there's, in the market happening. Yeah, right? there's all kinds of things going on out there. So it, it does, it's worrisome when, when all of a sudden things change and you're trying to roll with it, right? So this next one we have is CH212. And this is a six millimeter heavy flat cable chain. This one is spectacular. So I'm going to take this little card away because it seems to change things up. Okay, so this one is beauty. Look at that. So it's a regular cable chain, but it is really heavy duty. Mm -hmm. So if you're looking for a really good heavy looking chain, you can get this one for 45 cents an inch at 25% off by using the code FB Live during checkout. Look at that one. I love that. And we also have a little bit left in the antique copper. So you can see that one. There we go. That's a really good one. And this one is a soldered is that a soldered link yes that is a soldered link on that one too really yeah it looks like it isn't but it is a soldered link <laughs> yeah and then we have gunmetal so we have like the, the gunmetal and, and we also have that in gold too i know that's oh the gold's a different price so you will <laughs> find that some of the um yes this would be great for men's jewelry it would make a really great simple bracelet so this would also again be a great uh, layering necklace or you could just, um, I would love to have that as just a simple, um, I have to remember that I've got to put I, my hand forward on this one. I think we have a, um, like a heart charm that has like a, a thing on it. A thing on the top. <laughs> um, that would be really cute. Just, oh, that one. Yeah. Yeah. Connect yeah. It. It's almost like a Tiffany's bracelet. Yes. You know what I mean? Yeah. So this would make a really great little, little bracelet. So, um, so yeah. Those are the three colors available at that price. And then the gold generally, not always, but generally is, is more uh, because, you know, gold is more expensive. Do this one. Um, all right. Is uh, that, sorry, this one. Is this one? Yeah. Okay, so the, the CH212 gold is 65 cents an inch. All right, so there we go. So there is the gold. So we do have other golds available. We have in our regular uh, chain, we have Hamilton gold, which is more of a brushed gold. It's not quite so. We have a Hamilton know. we'll show. Do we have a Hamilton? Yes, we yeah, do have later. a little one 
a little bit there. Um, so our most of our a lot of our chains come in like six, seven different colors, but um, really good quality chains. So this is the CH212. Alrighty. Okay, now this chain is really fun. It's, no, it's the same one, sorry. We're huh? jumping back to this one. Oh. Yeah. It's... Oh, you missed one? Well, it's just the okay. gold. So we're going to jump back to one of the other ones we had, which is the CH821 gold. And this is 65 cents an inch. We don't have a lot of it left. You can see just a little bit on the spool there. But that is that really nice link chain in the gold. I'm just going to move that because that is not focusing. Look at yeah, how it picks up the... Words. Yeah, it's weird how it just really changed the um, focus. Hey, Kathy, how you doing? Thanks for joining us today. All right, so if you're just uh, joining us now, don't forget that this is all of a, on a new page. This is on our Facebook Live page that's on the website. And until midnight on Saturday, by using the code FB Live, you will save 25% on what's in that page only. All right, so this one is, um, this is the SHG though. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I'll show that one first. Yeah, there you go. So <laughs> SHG is Hamilton Gold. I don't know why they put the S first, but so this is CH213 and it's 11 millimeter uh, Hamilton Gold chain mail chain. And this is, yes, it is a little bit more expensive, but this one is so cool. This is $1.65 an inch. And again, you would save them um, on that. So we only have a little bit left of this. I'm just going to move that back there. Um, but look at this chain. This is the coolest chain. You can hang all sorts of things off of it. So like if you wanted to make like a, what do they call those chain, those bracelets? Um, charm bracelet. Like a charm bracelet kind of thing. <laughs> or I used this in a, a, um, a live about, I don't know, maybe four months ago where I took a little tiny piece and made it um, with a bracelet. I can't remember what I did, but I, I did like beads on one side and I just put a small bit because it is a little mm -hmm. bit on the expensive side. And you can open up this link here. It does have a um, open link. So you don't have to sacrifice like a whole, you don't have to cut it. You can open that up to try and, you know, save a little bit of it. But this is the um, SH213 in the Hamilton Gold. And that's all we've got left is this one piece. It's about 13 inches or something like that. So, yeah, this is very sort of steampunk looking. Mm -hmm. It's very cool. So there's that one. I don't know what happened to the other um, tag. Oh, okay. Uh, the, the difference is $1.25 for this. Okay. These so these are the same, the CH213, but they, uh, we don't have a tag on it. So this is the antique uh, copper and the antique brass. And again, so these ones were how much? A dollar? Dollar twenty-five. Dollar twenty-five an inch. So we do have a fair amount of the antique copper left. And then just remember to use the FB Live to save twenty-five percent off. Yeah, we're saying it a lot so that you know people do. Yeah, cause sometimes we put these codes out. What's going on? Yeah, cause sometimes we put these codes out. Oh, all right. <laughs> Does Something... my voice always sound like that, you guys? Yes. <laughs> okay. Are we are we still live? Uh, Can you go back to our live, like our, our faces up there? Yeah. Okay, there. Yeah, something was glitching there. I don't know what's mm -hmm. going on. Oh, it's still doing it. Okay, put it, put our main screen back up for a sec, the main one. It's, that one. That's the one that's not working. No, like the, put our main one, like you and I up, the I big know, screen. That's it. That's it? Yeah, it's not working. Oh. We're disconnected or something. Are we disconnected? No, they should. I think they can still hear us. I don't know what's going on. Huh. Mm. I don't know. Okay, that's weird. So, no, can you go back? They can like, see us. Can you go to that one there? That's that's just me, though, on my computer. Oh, is it? Yeah. This is would be us. Okay. Okay, we're going to just play we for a second. We see your hand. They can hear us. Okay. They can mm. That's weird. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, if we need to use our face, we'll just use my computer. Yeah, that's very weird. I, you know, oh, it's very, it's, I, I it's unsettling because I can't see up there. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. I'll have to watch in your computer. It's like cause... that's completely glitched. Yeah. Um, I wonder if you, if we, oh, we can't redo anything. No. Okay. Well, we're going to just have to wing it and hope for the best. Okay. Yeah. If you could do that, because then I can see if I'm on camera. Because sure. right now I can't tell if I'm on camera at all. <laughs> Is there anybody asking anything over on um, uh, Instagram? No. Okay. Okay, good. It's always something, right? Okay, what's the next one we've got? 
<laughs> as I'm having like 50 panic attacks. Right? We have a black screen, like literally yeah. a black screen. That's so um, bizarre. Do we have any other chains? Nope. Or is that all the chain? That's the chain. Okay, I'll get you to move those out of the way. Yep. Please and thank you. Okay, so the next thing I have is, um, so these, these are some things that we're getting rid of because we only have a um, few left. So this is the Tierra Cast Dolphin Charm. Uh, this is 94-2130-12. Um, yeah, this is so weird. Yeah, it's <laughs> it's like that, just completely yeah. shut down. Yeah, I okay. have no idea. Okay, so this is just a little um, Tierra Cast Charm, and it's a little dolphin. Is that... Yeah, okay. And these are sold um, by the each. By the each, yeah. And they're a dollar, dollar sixty a piece. And we only have what we have in there, which is maybe like, you know, six or eight yeah, or something like many. that. There wasn't a ton of them. Mm -hmm. So the code on that again is 94 2130 12. Okay. And then, oh, those <laughs> got wrapped around each other. We have uh, the Tierra Cast. Horseshoe, the antique gold one, it's 94 2281 26. And yeah, this is very disorienting, Wendy. I'm like, because. Do you want me to move the computer there? No, it's okay. okay. I can I can figure it out. I just, <laughs> okay. you'll have to tell me if I'm off. It's screen. all a little different today, too, because we're doing a different camera angle, but we've noticed with the different camera angle, there's not as many shadows and things show up a lot better. Yeah, you guys can actually see better, I think, when with this mm -hmm. angle versus the down. Um, it's just um, a little disorienting for me because <laughs> like I can't see what I'm doing. I'm trying. I'm trying my best here, but uh, so there we go. There's the horseshoe, and there is the code if you're wanting to buy the TRCast <laughs> Antique Gold Horseshoe. So we will not be carrying these any of these ones any longer. Even if um, somebody happily buys TRCast, we won't be carrying these any longer. So this is kind of your last kick at the can. So this is the TRCast Violet Leaf Charm in Antique Copper. And the code is 94-2011-18, and they're $2.25 a piece. And there is the beautiful charm. I love these ones. They're so pretty. Antique copper is really lovely. And, you know, mixed metals is really in, as it always has been. Mm -hmm. But it's really in, so you can mix this with any. I, I love mixing this with antique um, brass, antique bronze. Mm -hmm. So Wendy says she likes the new camera angle. Oh, good. Okay, yeah. good. You know, we just thought, well, try something a little different because I was just finding that things weren't showing up. It was just very, um, yeah, shadowy and so many shadows and the colors weren't true. And yeah, um, yeah, see, things seem to be showing a lot better with the angle this way. Yeah. So this is a Tearcast Sea Star Charm in Antique Gold, 94-2232-26. Uh, and these are $3 a piece. And that is what they look like. Just a nice little charm. So if you're into, you know, sea life, these are a great little charm. So this, mm -hmm. they're two-sided. That's the nice thing about Tierra Cast. So this is the, the right way up, and that's the back side. Um, so, yeah, sorry. There you go. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. Oh, goodness. All right. That's so weird. <laughs> I know. It's it very... It stopped loading comments, too. Oh, that's right. It's, it's like, completely frozen. Oh, it has. Yeah, mm -hmm. that is frozen over there. So, oh, yeah. Okay, well, you're going to have to let me know if anybody's yeah, saying I'm anything doing. on the comments. Oh, my gosh, this is really crazy. <laughs> Wendy can see the printed takes better, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is much easier because I can actually get it up. When it was mm -hmm. this way... I, it's hard. It was hard to have things level. And, yeah, I don't know. This yeah. was. This does seem to be working. This is 94-32412. This is the tier cast. Uh, poppy festoon link and they're five dollars and then again you would save 25 percent. so that would be what like you know three something these are a really cool link so this is the front side and you can see the poppies on it and then that's the back side and i thought that this would be a really neat um piece to add you know add some chain to it dangle some things off the front um it is a little bit malleable so you can um spread it back oh i don't want to do it because this would be somebody's piece but you can open it up ever so slightly, just gently. So if you wanted to make this a little bit wider in there, you could also push it together a little bit, I think. Um, so it is a little bit on the malleable side. I wouldn't do it more than once. So you kind of have to be committed. Once you bend metals, it doesn't like going backwards. Um, but there you go. So that is 94-32412, the Tierra Cast Poppy Festoon Link. Love those. Okay. <laughs> This is adding that extra layer of stress that, you know, always it gets really added. has thrown us off. <laughs> All right. Yeah, this is going to be really fun when I'm going to do my demo because I won't be able to see anything. 
that will be yeah that that's, <laughs> that's going to be really is. crazy oh well we'll figure it out okay so the first thing i'm going to show you is this one here oh jeez, uh, seriously <laughs> this is DD, DDE 156, and they're an 8 by 6 millimeter Old Rose AB Chinese crystal. Now, our price is only $2.99 on these crystals, and you're going to save another 25%. So these are dirt cheap. So, and Also, if you're in the States, you're going to save an additional 30 to 35% off, which your bank will adjust for you. Yeah, because our exchange rate in Canada is to the Junk. benefit of the uh, Americans and not to the Canadians, that's for sure. All right, so this is DDE156, and that is called 8x6, 8 millimeter Old Rose AB. You can actually see the colors a lot better this way, too. Yeah, it's really working. Uh, I went to the site but couldn't see the product you have been talking about. Um, we can try and show you again. So it's it's in a drop-down menu called Facebook Live. It's the second, it's the second thing yeah. if you go into online shopping. Mm -hmm. Are you warm? I'm sweating because I'm... Yeah. I'm, I'm going to turn that little fan on. It's hot in here. I'm freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this has been... This is a lot today. And my... my uh, you know, somebody says, don't stress. Just keep going. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. All right. We have DEE 029. And these are a light lavender luster. 5 by 8 millimeter faceted Chinese crystal. The regular price is $3.99. And again, using the code FBLIVE, you'd save 25%. So these are super pretty. Look at that color and that luster on there. It's, I like it because it's not the AB finish. It's just got a luster. So it's a really lovely coating on there. So pretty. It is really pretty. Yeah. Okay, so that is DEE029. I better show that again because some, we have DDE and DEE. So make sure you, you go after the DEE if you're looking at that one. Hey, Holly. Yeah, just beady goodness. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to just leave some of these up here so you can still see how pretty they are. All right, this next one is DDE101, and these are a 6x5 millimeter medium aquamarine pearl luster, and they're $3.99, or again, saved you 25% by using code FB Live. All right, so I'm going to show you these. Look how pretty that is. It is really a beautiful, mm -hmm. soft aquamarine color. Super pretty. I love it. And these are a really nice size. They're a six by five. So they're six millimeters across and then five millimeters in, um, sorry, in depth or in height. Super pretty. And they've got that beautiful luster finish. So I'll just leave some of those up there just so you can see them again. So Linda, you'll go on to kellysbeadboutique.com and you can purchase everything there. I'll just put on. Yeah, we'll just let that website. run for a second there. Look how um, pretty those two together are. <laughs> yeah, those look really nice. All right, the next one is a Czech glass bead, and this is ABD608, and they're a 14 millimeter dahlia, and it, the color is purple pansy with gold luster and metallic pink wash. That is one heck of a mouthful. And they're $11.99, and I've got them on 25% off using that code again. So you just go over to the website and look for the, what is the page actually called? Could you tell me what the is called? Yep the top of the page if it's a sec if you go to online shopping and then go down to the second um category it says facebook and youtube live products and that's where you will find all of these so this one is these dahlia beads and this is an older one so it has oh i, I gotta go up there mm -hmm. this this is one strand that has a little bit of a, a lighter color but most of the strands will look like this they're a really rich dark purple um, sort of, they have like that metallic gold um, wash over them. Is that coming up okay? Yep. Yeah? Yep. Yeah, right there. That's a good mm -hmm. representation of what we've got there. So that is ABD608 if you're looking for those on the website. So they're eleven ninety nine, and then you'll save 25% if you use that code. Yeah. <laughs> I keep looking at that black screen going, oh, we're gone. No, we're not. We're still live. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we've got some semi-precious to show you. So we have ABC 304. They're a six millimeter yellow mookite, and they were $14.49 a strand, which is already a really good price for these yellow mookite. And then you would save 25% again using that code. So 
This is the yellow mukite. Look at that color. It is so cool. Yeah, I really like it. Yeah. It is coming up a little bit green. It is definitely not green. <laughs> yeah, it is not green at all. No, it is yeah. really a nice true gold. Mm -hmm. I mean, they call it yellow, but it like is a mustard, a, yeah. like a dark mustard yeah, yellow. Yeah, it is actually a very mustardy kind of color. Mm -hmm. So that is ABC 304, and it's a six millimeter yellow mukite for $14.49. I'll just keep piling them up here. Do you guys like it when I leave some of these out so that you can still keep seeing them? Try something different today. <laughs> every week. Every, we try <laughs> yeah, every week, every, every day, we're always trying something different. All right, and we have the uh, parent to this one, the ABC 326, and it's an 8 millimeter yellow mukite, and the regular price is $16.99. And then, you, of course, you will get your sale on that. So there we go. A spicy mustard. Yes, Anita, that's that. that's a good one. Are you it's a feeling, Dijon. <laughs> are you feeling better this week, Anita? I know you said you weren't feeling good last week, so you missed us. I hope you're feeling better. All right. Yes, is this a Dijon mustard or just a spicy mustard? Spicy. All right. We have... Try to get these little suckers up. Come on. <laughs> this is BBC 009. It's a 6 millimeter. Check glass, melon arted, and the color is. <laughs> okay, can I rewind my lips on that one? <laughs> All right, it's a six millimeter check glass melon bead, and the color is artichoke with Picasso, and they're four eighty five. And again, these are on sale for twenty five percent off, which is a. Oh, is that? I thought it was the other. Okay, sorry, Anita. Okay, well, wrong. hopefully you're doing well too, Anita. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's the other Anita. Yeah, <laughs> we have two Anitas. All right, so there is the. So they're just a six millimeter melon bead and they have a beautiful green to them. Like it's a really nice sort of mossy green, mm -hmm. really pretty. And I think the picture oh, doesn't look so great on, on the, on the um, website, but they are a real nice juicy green. Mm -hmm. So that is BBC 009. Yes, there's the other Anita, sorry. <laughs> I'm glad you're feeling better. Okay, that's good. All Anitas are well. Good. good. See, I did have, I do have some sort of a memory. All right, the next one is BBB 076, and this is an eight millimeter blue aura quartz for eight dollars and forty nine cents, and then you will save twenty five percent using the code FB Live. So this is BBB 076. So aura quartz is just a quartz. Um, they're man made, you know, but they've um, they they've added this sort of like gold. I don't know what they do, but they color treat it and heat it and all that stuff. So everybody knows they're dyed and they're heat treated. They're not, in, they don't come out of the earth looking like this, but they're really pretty, you know, and they're just super popular. And this has been a very popular color, but it's time for it to find new homes. So this is BBB 076 and they're eight millimeter blue aura quartz. And most of our aura quartz is matte, but this one is not matte. This is the shiny. So it's just got a really different tone to it. It's pretty like that. I really like that one too. Yeah, the color is pretty. Beachy. We'll see what happens with me leaving that there. All right. Um, this is a good basic one to have, ABB165, and this is a six millimeter off-white lava stone for six dollars and ninety-nine cents. Thanks. All right, see if, if I've got other beads in the back, if it still, does it still pick yeah. it up? All right, so this is ABB165. And they are a six millimeter uh, off white lava. So, again, just a good, you know, basic bead, good coming into spring and summer for all that, you know, lighter colored jewelry that you want. I like that you can put essential oils on those too. Yeah, so if you are using lava stones for essential oils, just make sure that you're not dousing your bead in, la in, um, in the essential oil. You wanna put a drop on it and let it kind of air out before you're, you know, adding other things. Um, when we, when I had my brick and mortar store, uh, the, we, we could not keep lava in the store. It flew out. I, I would sell it like a hundred strands in a week. It was crazy because everybody was buying lava for the essential oils. But then sometimes people would come back and say, oh my gosh, my bead dissolved or this dissolved or that, that dissolved because the, the, um, oils are actually caustic. If you put them in on their, um, raw form, they can be quite caustic. So we always just suggest putting one drop and then seeing how it lands and what happens to it and versus dousing your entire bracelet in the, because um, we had so many things and we had to do a little bit of, 
you know, figuring things out along the way to see what was going on. So it wasn't, we sell our beads to make jewelry, not to have things put on them. Yeah. But um, we wanted to make sure that we still could provide beads for people. We just had to, you know, better inform them. I wonder them. if you mixed it with like a carrier oil, if it would last better, because that's technically what you're supposed to do with them. Probably. Yeah. Instead yeah. of the direct oil, you're supposed to mix it with like a... Um, a carrier oil. Yeah, like grapeseed oil, like so many different oils you can use. Yeah, as long as it wouldn't go rancid or something, I don't know. No, it's yeah, you're supposed to. Okay. And does it change the color of? I don't. I don't have an answer for that, color? Wendy, because I've. I'm. I'm not. Um, I never have done it, so I'm not really too sure. And most people stick with the black, um, but I mean, you could sacrifice one bead and try it. I would. I would mm -hmm. take one of the white beads. Try it, let it sit for a week or two, and then see if it discolors. Because uh, I, I can't really speak to it. I, can, I could give you a bunch of BS, but I'm not going to do that. So, <laughs> right? It's one of those things that you kind of have to try out and, and see what happens. So the next one I've got here is BBB 500, and it's the last of our six millimeter cloudy quartz strands. And these are $6.49. And again, you will save 25% uh, using the code FBLIVE. So that's it. That's all we've got left is two of our six millimeter cloudy quartz. They're such a good basic stone. Mix that with some black or some white, super pretty. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's BBB 500. Okay, and the next one we've got just a few strands left of ABD 650, six millimeter gold stone bead strands, and they're $3.99. So ABD 650, and we only have two, two, two strands left. Yep. of that. So that's a six millimeter gold stone. That one seems to be a perennial favorite. Everybody always loves gold stone. It's so pretty. Yeah, it is quite pretty. There we go. Oh, that's pretty. That looks yeah. good. Does that look good there? Mm -hmm. You could even go a little closer if you want. Can I? Yeah. There you go. Oh, wow. This new angle. Yeah, you can get really close. You can get so close. Yeah, and the color looks really good. It, it's blurry because it's picking up the tag. No, if you got it? even closer, you would... No, no, the tag on the strand. Oh. If you got even closer, it would... Uh, there you go. Make sure it's in focus. I don't know. I was trying to take pictures yesterday <laughs> of the project that I'm doing today, and it would not focus. It didn't matter <laughs> what I did. I was like, what in the heck? All right. One of my favorites, uh, BBV805, and this is a 6 millimeter green quartz, and this is $7.49. Uh, 505, not 805. What? You said 805. Oh, BBV505. Okay. My brain's not. Or maybe I heard wrong. Okay, I thought I said 505, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is a really pretty green quartz. It's just exactly what it says, just a nice green quartz. It's got lots of variations in the color. We've run from the, you know, almost translucent kind of color right up to a nice deep. This almost looks like that, uh, like the... Um, the melons? Like the melons. Oh, like yeah. that. Look nice, at that together. Yeah, that's a really that's nice cool. companion stone together. Look at that. I love that. So now this is six millimeter and this is six mil millimeter. But as I've explained um, on many of my lives, when they are making the beads now in China, they're given a rough of a certain size and then they're trying to make beads with the wrong size rough. And so the beads are not all consistent any longer. You know, like all six millimeter strands don't look alike. Like even this bead is smaller than that bead. So, you know, it's just the way things have changed um, when, when you're getting your, your beads made, they're not all sixes are going to be identical in size and not all eights are going to be identical in size. It's just kind of the way things have, um, gone now. So this one is BBB 505 and they're only 749, less 25%, which is such a good deal. I hate when everyone's so quiet because I always think it's freezing, but I think they're just content watching. Yeah. I know. I always <laughs> and it's hard too. because that froze. So now I'm like, yeah, we don't know what's going on. Mm -hmm. All right. And then we've got the parent to that one. We've got BBB 509. We've got eight millimeter green quartz for $8 and 49 cents. And I don't know how the, if there's any of these left at the end, I would be very surprised because these are just so pretty. And for that mm -hmm. price for like $7, you're going to get beautiful, beautiful beads. Now, if you're new to, um, <laughs> you're all ordering Jennifer. Thank you. <laughs> um, if you are new to the channel and you've never bought from us before, uh, we do have flat rate shipping. Um, and in Canada, yes, it does look on the high side, but if we can uh, um, rebate you some of that money, we do. We put it back into your account, and so it's always there for you to spend because the uh, shipping is ridiculous, and so I have to kind of watch it, and then we just have to, you know, rebate it where we can. So, all right. 
These are so pretty. Yeah. We, I always say that about this type of stone. Yeah, well, because they're they're a bit more on the precious side. They're like they're a beautiful quality stone. Mm -hmm. This is ABC 397 and they're eight millimeter iolite strands for $21.49. I don't understand why these are still here. Oh, I know. I don't I don't understand. So ABC 397. If I bought beads, I'd buy these. <laughs> <laughs> we only have four left, and these are a beautiful quality iolite. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Very, very good quality iolite. Is that picking it up pretty good? Yeah, I think so. It's a little blurry. Is it? Could be because there's better. so many. That's better. Because there's so many other beads I'm back there. I think that might be it. Yeah. I don't know. I never know how That's to get that. That's perfect there, right there. That it's works? not blurry at okay. all. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, these are beautiful. So this is ABC 397 and we only have four of them. Now I know that these are old stock. So um, when I get them back in, they'll probably, like these were $42.99 originally, and then we put them down to $21.49. They are going to be way more in price if I get Iolite again. A lot of strands have gone way skyrocketing up in price. You were you were saying that from the things that we bought in Tucson to now. Oh my right gosh. Now it's night and day. Yeah, it's crazy. The prices are, have just gone way up. Um, ABC 138. These are a six millimeter blue tiger's eye strand for $9.49. And um, these are a nice dark blue. And yes, they are dyed, of course. You know, even Mother Nature can't make something this pretty. Now, my, some people have said they're not, but I don't see how that can come from the earth like that. So I am 9,000% sure they're dyed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you know what? Like, so what if they're dyed? You know, a lot of things are dyed and color treated these days. My think... hair's dyed and I'm still pretty. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Everything's dyed. <laughs> I just think they're really pretty. And I like that they're not all the same color. Like, mm -hmm. they have, a, you know, different depths of color along the way. A bit of a gradient there. And they're super pretty. So, uh, this is ABC 138 six millimeter blue tiger eye and they're 949 less 25% using code FB live. So don't forget that if you're using that code, it is only going to work on the things that I have shown you today, which are on that new page that you will find under Facebook and YouTube, YouTube lives. All right. ABC 126. These are a six millimeter Robin Robin's egg blue Terra Jasper. And these are $8.49. How are these not sold? Did I we buy these in Tucson? No, I've had these for a long time. Oh, I think it's so the pictures, nice. you know, like when it's an older picture on the website, I don't think people see them. And I mean, these are like, it's, it kind of looks like a Mazinite to me in a way, but mm -hmm. I don't know. It's not, but it's just a really beautiful beachy, turquoisey kind of robin's egg blue. Yeah. Yeah. It's very pretty. And again, these are going to be dyed. These are $8.49 and they're ABC 126. So, Julie, mm -hmm. you're going to go to our website, kellysbeadboutique.com, and do your place any orders there. Yeah, yeah we, we haven't been able to figure out a way that you can order on Facebook. So if you go to my website, you can see all of the other things that we have. I'll pop up the website. Yeah. All right. And then is this the last thing this we've got here? This is the last thing. And then and I do then have a tutorial. tutorial for you. What How are we doing for time? Oh, oh. good. Cam's going to pick up Grace. Okay, good. All right, so ABC 401, and this is a six millimeter gray lace agate, and this is $8.49. And that is the last of the beads. And these are a six millimeter, and these are all regular holes. They're not large hole beads of any kind today. Uh, so they all have like, you know, about a, a 0 0.7, 0 0.8 millimeter hole. Maybe some of them go as big as one millimeter. Um, and they are all full long 16 inch strands, unless they were the check glass beads. And then they're all just, you know, the smaller strands. But if you look in the listing, I always say exactly what, um, this, the length of the strands are or how many beads you can expect to get in it. So it gives you fairly good descriptions on everything. So, all right. So everything that I showed you here today, if you pop on over to the website, you can get the 25% off until, uh, Saturday night at midnight, uh, Pacific standard time. And, um, there you go. So that's our new thing this week. And uh, hopefully you guys really like this. So we're going to just take two seconds and clean up here. Oh, and yeah, then I'm going to, um, yeah, we didn't think about that part. <laughs> but you know, I, did you guys like me leaving the beads? We'll do a little poll here where we're cleaning up. Did you like me sort of piling the beads up there so you could see some of them? Or do you like a nice clean mat? Yeah. Would you rather that I just focused on what we have normally there? Because 
We're trying to always see what works best for you guys and for us too. So. Barbara liked it. Paul likes it. Martha. Which tab on your website for these items? So Julie, you're going to go to the um, online shopping tab and then the second one down, which is Facebook and YouTube live products is the um, tab you're going to click on and all of the items that we showed today will be there. Okay, I need uh, I need some screen back so I yeah, sorry. <laughs> because we've lost our screen. If you're wondering what's going on, uh, we are we have a black screen that I'm looking at, and so we can only see on Savannah's computer, which and, is like behind a bunch of stuff. yeah. And so I can't really see too well. So um, you know, there's always something challenging. I, I I feel like every week we are given a challenge, and uh, we're uh, um. You'll notice if you're new here and you continue coming back, it's a bit of a gong show. <laughs> yeah, but it's a good Kong show. Yeah. Okay, am I, am I, am I yeah. going to show up if I'm there? Yeah, you're good. I'm yeah. just okay. going to remove our banners. Okay. And so, now I've got to get organized for my project. Oh, it's very weird not having our faces up. You can't get our faces back at all, eh? No, it's completely frozen. Like, this has not loaded anything since it froze. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Oh, thanks, Julie. I think we're a really good team, too. If you, if you don't know who, um, who we are... Uh, Savannah is actually my daughter-in-law, and I we get along very well. Yeah, we survived Tucson together in the same room. Yeah, it's um, fine. We both have the same sort of uh, quick, sar quick sarcastic wit. Yeah, uh, we both love my son or her husband, mm -hmm. and we have um, we have fun together. Yeah, yeah, we enjoy each other's company, and we get each other. Mm -hmm. And so, Savannah helps me out every week doing this and she picks orders and stuff too. Yep. Um, I'm just kind of and, trying uh, to figure out. Something you may not know about me is I work at a bead store and I don't love making jewelry. You know what I need? <laughs> I, need, need? I, I need the, the bag that this all came in because I don't have my parts with me. Oh, okay. <laughs> I just went to put this together. I'm like, you know what? I don't have the parts. It should be sitting on the desk there, I think. Yeah. All right. So last week or a couple weeks ago or whatever, we made... Um, a uh, what do you call it a sun catcher and we're going to make another one because you all loved it and um this one is so cute this one's cute and it's made differently so i just have to get all the bits and bobs here and normally we would have um our faces showing but you know we can't so saying goodbye is going to be different this week because you won't have our faces well we can do it on my computer and it's just going to look a little okay so I need, Sideways. um, you need everything. I need two of those. Is that the barrel one? I need two of those, please. <laughs> we really messed up guys. <laughs> you know, we were very busy beforehand. We were, yeah. You guys don't mind, right? And then we're going to use one of these moon, uh, connectors. And then we need a star connector and one of those rings. Yeah. See, and I thought I had all of this out there yesterday, but it might've all got put away, which obviously it did. These? I need, um, yes. I need... I don't have a star card. Oh, here's one. Yeah, so we are going to use um, some crimp covers and crimps. I'm going to be showing you all the things today on how to do all of the stuff. So... Oh, good, Linda. Yeah, that was a pretty one. This one is, is completely different and equally as pretty, but just completely different. Um, everybody's saying leave those out when we when we put them out so that's what we'll do we'll just start piling beads up sure we may play with our angles a little bit more i need two of those those beads yeah mm -hmm. two of those guys <laughs> sorry guys we we're trying to we're not you know, normally this normally i have this all ready but um i i thought i did in my little tray but i only have parts of it and then i need seven of this um green one this one this one here and then i need two four Six, I think, of the other one. I need six yeah, of that one and seven of this one. I'll just get this one here. <laughs> all right, we'll get this all figured out. We're almost there. Yeah. Anything else we need, we'll, we'll grab as we go along the way. Bye, Catherine. Thanks for joining us. All right. Take care, my friend. Be good. And if you can't be good, then be really bad, okay? Yeah, that's fun. <laughs> okay, I think... Um, one, two, two three, four, five. Okay, we got all the things. I actually have a, a, a made one here because um, I didn't make this. Lori, that works for me, she created this. And so um, I'm, I'm just making what she made. 
Okay, so uh, we have all kinds of stuff here, and I think you can all see it. Is it? Are we still on? Yeah, you're good. Should this? You might want to push that back a bit. Yeah. In that way. A little bit. Yeah. That's that better. way. Okay. All right. So we have this really cute little star um, charm. It was like a pendant. And then we also have our moon pendant. So we're, we call this one the moon and star or something like that pendant. And this is, if you go over to our kits, we have this under the accessories section. And then I also have an assortment of um, Chinese crystals. There's like four different kinds of crystals. We have a ring. This is so discombobulating not being able to see what I'm doing. <laughs> I have a little bit of chain. I have two different kinds of jump rings. I have a six millimeter 18 gauge and a eight millimeter 18 gauge. I have a couple head pins that have balls on the end of them. I have a couple of crimps and some crimp covers. I have a little bit of wire and that was supposed to be silver wire, but you know what? We're just going to use what we've got today. And then I've got a bit of medium soft flex. Okay. So let's get started. Now, I think the easiest thing to do today is move all of this stuff out of the way. And I'm going to start by making a couple little charms. So You've got to tell me if I'm off camera too, because yeah, no, you're doing. Can't great. see. All right, so I'm just going to uh, just make a, a little uh, wrapped loop. So I'm going to put my pliers down at the end there, and then I'm going to bend away, and then I'm going to take my round nose pliers and just come in here and make a wrapped loop. And if I'm going too fast today, uh, Wednesdays are a bit more um, about just the project versus the uh, technical aspect of it. I have um, close to 300 videos over on my YouTube channel. If you've uh, never seen them before, hop on over there and make sure to, um, you know, like the channel, follow it, um, subscribe, all those like things. Like and subscribe. Yeah, all those things. Grace says that when she pretends to be a YouTuber. Yeah. It drives me nuts. <laughs> You're six. How did, yeah, how does she know about all that stuff? Because she watches kids' YouTube. Yeah. She's, she likes to watch these girls that play with, like, um, reborn dolls. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. One of the um, guys that works for my husband, he um, is completely enamored with the fact that I have a silver play button because I have over 100,000 subscribers. Um, <laughs> and he just like literally thinks that I am, I am the, I am it. Like the bee's knees. Oh yeah, I am the bee's knees because yeah. I have something that uh, nobody else has. So, all right. So I'm doing that again on one of these sort of um, beautiful green iridescent, um, sort of a hex, I don't know, that's like a hexagon kind of shape. So I'm making another little charm on that one. And you know, these are glass, so you've got to be careful when you're, when you're creating uh, wrapped loops next to glass. You want to be mindful that you're not getting your wire too close. And then um, when you're trimming it off, um, you know, you don't want to... I've get, cracked a lot you of wanna, polish. Yeah, you, you got to be careful. <laughs> so what I do suggest on this is not worry so much about getting the burrs down and being um, completely perfect because this is not jewelry that you're going to wear. This is a, a piece that you're going to give to a friend or to your mom or hang it a, in your house. Hang it in your house. So like me, I'm crazy and I, I, I get right in there. But you can see where I put my tool on this side. I don't go like that. I'm just putting the tip on the end of the burr there to try to get it down. I, I am very careful when I do that. All right. So I have to try and figure out how Lori put this together. So we've got... Um, this little one here, I am going to put together with, what size did she use on there? Is that one of the bigger ones? Yes, that's a big one. So this is one of the eight millimeter open jump rings. So I'm just going to open that up. Now this can be a little tricky. You kind of have to, you know, I don't know. You have to sort of fiddle, fiddle and have like three hands. So what I'm going to try to do is get that all through there and then back up through this loop. And I said to her yesterday, I'm like, how, how did you get that in there? So you kind of have to, you know, fiddle a little bit. And I found that by doing that, by holding my thumb that way and locking that in there, that meant that I could then grab my bent chain nose pliers, grab that by the very end, and then close that up. So once you get a grip on it, then you can do it. And I, I always want to make sure that I'm sort of jiggling that back and forth. And what that does now is that just hangs it perfectly in the middle there. Look how cute that's looking. That is really cute. Yeah. So then now we're going to take a little bit of wire and it's, I probably, um, you know, this is probably like too heavy of a wire, but that's what we're going to use. And I just need, I think we probably, I wonder if we made up the kits. Yeah, I think she did. <laughs> oh, well. 
you know, whatever wire you get in there, just make it work. Okay, so I'm going to create a wrapped loop on either side. I'm just trying to see, did she attach that? Yes, she did. Okay, I really have to just copy what she did because I didn't create this. I have to, you know, see what she did. So I'm going to take one end and I'm going to put it through that loop there. Now, if by chance you forgot to add the loop and you and you got one of these kits, because these are available for um, $12.99 as a kit, um, and let's say you just made this away and then you completely forgot about putting that on there, um, you could use a jump ring. It just is going to look a little different, but you know, again, Maybe a little longer. It's going to be just a little longer. Yeah. Nothing's nothing's wrong. And then you know you can kind of come in here and just make sure that that burr is down. And then now I'm going to put on one of these little sort of squishy beads. And then I do want these loops going the same direction. So when I um, do my next uh, loop here, I'm going to make sure that the loop is this facing me this way, not that way. And then that will guarantee that they go in the same direction. And then I'm going to, I'm going to make a little bit bigger loop on the other end. I'm going to go a little larger. Can we still see there? Mm -hmm. Yep, you're doing great. Going a little bigger because what I have to do, I'm just trying to get that evened out. So there, that's what we've got so far. I now need to come into this part here. Is that where she went in there? Yeah, so in this part here, there's like a an opening in here. And she has it directly below the um, loop on the top, if yeah. that makes sense. Yeah. So we just need to have this a little bit larger to get in there. And then wrap that up. Now again, if you can't, if you couldn't get that in or you forgot and you made this, you know, in advance and you went, oh gosh, I was supposed to put that in the moon, just attach it with a large jump ring. You know, there's always a solution. Um, I often say that jewelry making, and yeah, I know this isn't really jewelry, but same sort of thing. Um, Jewelry making is just a, a series of problems that need to be solved. It's like, how am I going to get to that end thing that I want to achieve? Can you just hang on one sec? Uh, is everyone frozen or just Diane? I just want to make sure you don't go too far ahead and you're okay. frozen. I'm going, to have a, I'm going to have a sip of water while we're yeah. answering that question because my, um, my throat is getting parched. Mm. Let's just see what, if anyone else hops on and says if we are frozen are or not. Are we frozen? We're having technical difficulties today. Uh, yeah, everyone says they're good. Okay, okay, so we're good. Might be Diane. She lives over in the boonies. <laughs> <laughs> we get it. Okay, I'm just going to try. Okay, there we go. So that's what we've got happening so far. Now I'm going to take this one and hang it from here, doing the same thing that I did um, down here, but I'm going to use a little bit smaller ring. So I'm going to open up my 6 millimeter 18 gauge ring. And that's why I like to have these bent chain nose. They work perfectly for that. I'm going to turn that. And then just you're, what you're going to do is kind of come through the back end like that. And then just kind of brace your finger there or your thumb underneath so that you can get a hold of this jump ring. And then you're going to kind of boss it around. Hi, Mom. Is Mom on there? Yeah. She's on Instagram. Oh, thanks for joining us today. All right, we're having technical difficulties and we're not even swearing, Wendy. Well, we, we silently are screaming in our heads, but all right, so there we go. Oh, she shouldn't have watched this because we were going to give her this for Mother's Day, right? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I all mean, right. I guess I could. I hadn't thought about it. I should I'm probably just, start thinking. About I'm just that. bugging you. Okay, so that's what we've got happening so far. Is everybody with us? Okay, now I'm going to take my piece of Softlex and I am going to run it through. I'm going to put a. a, a um, a crimp tube on it. So we like to use the two by two crimp tubes here in Kelly's Bee Boutique because we find them to be superior in quality. So I'm going to run that through there. I'm having like a complete brain fart going, how do I even do this? <laughs> <laughs> it's just one of those days, you know, there's been a lot today. All right, so I've got my long end coming out the left and my short end going in there. And I'm going to put it through and I want to make sure that those two ends don't get crossed over. So I'm mindful that they're not crossing and I do that by holding on to them. And I just kind of split it and then that's what we're going to have there. And I'm going to use a pair of crimp pliers. And you can see that there's two different um, sort of shapes at the um, top of here. We have like what looks like a, an oval and then we have kind of a little taco. So we're going to go into the first one which is like a little taco. 
and I want to make sure that nothing is crossed over. So I actually spread mine apart like that. And then when you crimp it, that makes the um, uh, two wires go in the channel. And then you're going to turn it at 45 degrees, or is that 90 degrees? I don't know. 90. 90 degrees. And then you're going to crimp using the outside one. So each wire goes through their own channel. Yes. And then I always come in and give it another smush, making sure that you're doing it the right way. You don't want to go on top because it'll open it back up. And now there's no way that that is coming apart. So now you can come in and go really close and crimp that off or cut that off. And now you've got a really strong crimp. Now, because we want to make this little extra, we're going to put crimp covers on. You don't have to put crimp covers on. Um, they're not the easiest things to work with, but we're going to, you know, manhandle them today. So what you do is just push it over top and then I give it like a little squish together and then I get myself resituated because they never squish together in the way that we want. So this one, am I still okay? Yeah. Uh, started, started to kind of go off center. So I'm just kind of bossing it back into position. Now what I'm going to do, you can see that it has like what looks like a little, is that showing up like a little Pac-Man? Mm -hmm. Did somebody say we're freezing on their side uh, too? It's where they're driving. Oh, okay. So don't worry. So it looks like a little sort of Pac-Man there. I'm really dating myself. So it's like a little opening. So what I'm going to do is on one side, I'm going to push down gently. And then on the other, I'm going to push down. And I kind of go back and forth. And everybody has different methods of closing crimp covers. So if you close your crimp covers in a different way than I do, then that's perfectly fine. But I find that that's the best way to get a nice closed crimp cover without um, mushing it down. Mushing being the technical word. Anata, Anita uses sentence enhancers? with the crimp cover? I don't know what that is. Okay, I thought it was just me. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, I don't know what that is. All right, so now we're gonna start stringing our beads on. Now, if you buy this kit, you can um, load your beads up in any uh, fashion that you like, but this is just kind of what I did for my, um, you know, just in the sort of design that I did yesterday. And so I just did like, a clear and a green, a clear and a green, clear and a green, any with a green. And then I put one of these beautiful sort of hexagonal beads on there. And then I put a green and a clear and then a green. I need one more green, please. And then we use this sort of tubular bead or a column bead. And this green? Yes, please. And we're getting to the end here. Sorry, I'm trying to find one. There we go. All right, so then we're going to end with... Oh, I guess I counted my beads wrong. Who knows? All right, I think that's what we have. <laughs> yeah, that, that. I'm just kind of going with what... Yep, that's perfect. Okay, so now I am going to put my um, crimp bead on. And then I am also going to put on my little piece of chain. So you're going to get about three inches of this really good quality chain that we sell. And you're going to make sure that you run that through the end. Now, again, if you forget to add that chain to the end here, just add it with a jump ring after. Don't panic and go, oh, no, I wrecked my whole thing. So I'm going to run the end through there and I'm going to pull that down. And I don't want to cram that in there really, really tight because I want to leave room for my crimp cover. So I'm going to close it up, but I'm not going to make it really tight in there. Okay. And I'm going to use the taco side first and then turn it and use the outer one. And then I'm going to come in and give that another good squish. And then I, that is not going anywhere. So when you trim that off, you don't have to be afraid of trimming because it's not going to fall apart. Then you're going to take your crimp cover. Now, you can use your fingers to put, the, put them on, but for demo purposes, I use my uh, pliers like that so that I can get it started, because otherwise, how do I do that, right? So that you can see. So I'm just going to kind of close that up a little bit. And then I kind of go in on the top, and then I just gently go from side to side. And, you know, sometimes uh, they just don't want to cooperate. I think in the kit we give you one extra one, I think. Um, because, you know, sometimes they don't, they don't turn out. And there we go. Okay, now the last thing we're going to do is we're going to use one of the small six millimeter jump rings. 
and we are going to attach our ring. So we give you this ring at the top and then you can um, use whatever you like to hang these. You can use um, string or you know whatever you like to hang them up in whichever fashion that you like with your... I like using the little suction cups and put it on a window. Yeah. I think they look really cute. So there you go. There is our new sun... What is that? What did I call it? What did I call this? My moon and star? I can't remember what I called it. It's under kits, accessories... Accessory you kits. should have named it to the moon, Alice. Yeah, yeah. Moon and Stars Sun Catcher Kit for twelve ninety nine. I think it is super fun. I can't see mm -hmm. if I can um, if I can Sorry. see this on my thing now. Yeah. So there we go. Super cute, eh? And super easy to throw together. So there you go. We managed to do that with no camera that I could see. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you want to okay. try and we're going to see if we can switch over to here. Um, there we go. Yeah, we're kind of like... This is a weird angle now. Uh, <laughs> there. There we go. <laughs> I'll just, I'll smoosh over. A, yeah, it's very strange that I we like don't... I like it better when it's up high because it gets rid of the double chin. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there mm -hmm. we go. That looks much better. I'll just do this. Yeah. <laughs> this is a very, very weird thing today, not having the cameras working, but we're making it work, so... I feel like All everything's right. been off today. Yeah, it's just been one of those days because we had a lot going on this morning. So don't forget to head on over to the website at www.kellysbeeboutique.com, spell Kelly with an I-E, and um, use code FB Live, all in one word, FB Live, so Facebook Live, and um, you will save 25% on what I showed you to date, not on the Suncatcher and not on the uh, Tierra Cast earrings, but all of the other stuff. You can save 25% until midnight on Saturday. So thank you so much for putting up with all the shenanigans today, with all of the cameras not working and all of the stuff. And thank you to all the people that joined us um, over in on Instagram. We do appreciate that. Uh, we're, that's something new for us to be on Instagram too. We're kind of all over now. We're everywhere. Mm -hmm. And uh, watch over on uh, TikTok for um, Savannah's first spicy uh, voiceover, video. voiceover video that she did today. Super fun. <laughs> We're, we're just having some fun with things. So <laughs> sentence enhancers when you're using colorful words. Oh, <laughs> I use a lot of sentence enhancers. Yes, I use a lot of sentence enhancers too, I think. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Well, you guys go off and make some fabulous jewelry. Thanks again for all the uh, love. And make sure if you are haven't subscribed or haven't liked pages, please do all of the above. We really appreciate it. And we will see you back here next week. All right. Have a great day, everybody. Bye-bye. Oh, my God, try it. Yeah. <laughs> Holding my computer with one hand. <laughs>